Hi YouTubers, it's Dave here from the Webs channel and I thought I would bring to you this sort of an unboxing or unbagging in this case of this Sand Series case for the MacBook, in this case my MacBook Pro, 13 inch MacBook Pro. Um, and I thought I'd do that and actually attempt, let's say, to fit it to my MacBook in this video too. So, just to show you, here is my MacBook Pro on the ready. So, without any further ado, let's get this over. Like so, we're gonna get this out of this packaging. And then, like I said, take a quick look at it. Take a quick look at it and try and fit it to my MacBook itself so you can see what it looks like. So, that comes out of the packaging very nicely, indeed. It's just a grip seal bag. Let's get that to one side, so it's quite noisy. Packaging. We also have this both dropped out, so we've got some sort of little, what is this? I don't know, some quality thing I'm guessing. Quality assurance I'm guessing that is. We've also then got this bag here of what appears to be little grommets, etc., um, to go into some of the various media slots, USB, um, obviously the power, and that's going to be for the SD card slot, etc. Anyway, so that looks like that. that's what they are for. So let me get there what looks like a laptop. <laughs> if you look at it like that, it does look like a laptop. Um, obviously, this is a case for the laptop. So let's try and get this packaging off, which is sealed to this extremely tightly. I'm just trying to find some way in at the moment. There we go. There's a way. So once we get a way in, hopefully we can get this off. He says, fairly straightforward. Take it back over here. Okay, so there we go. That's that off. It still has some, still has protection on it in there as well. So that's one bit off, and even they're protected individually. So now is the challenge to get these ones off. Okay, we may have to get my no. I'm not going to get my knife, but I'll be reluctantly doing that because I don't want to put any unnecessary scratches or anything on these. Okay, so first off, I can say they are very <laughs> well packaged um, to keep them protected. So that's obviously the lid section. Right, we also have, that's just going to be to keep them together, I guess, some sort of packaging. We then have installation guide. And there. Okay, just put that to one side. So that's the base. Ah, that's interesting. So the base hasn't got an extra layer of... Uh, uh, packaging stroke protection on it. So anyway, there's the base. You can see there are um, grills there, vents. That's obviously going to be for the cooling, um, etc. To keep the MacBook cool, or to help too, we should say. So that's the base. We then take a look at the lid, like so. Okay, so let's now attempt to, without even, should we actually look at the instructions? I think we need to, do we? We're going to get my MacBook Pro. Should have cleaned it first, really, but hey, across and work out what goes where. So, looking at that side, that's going to be the front, we think. Yeah, that must be. I'm guessing that's the front. Or not, because that's going to cover those, so that's got to be wrong. Let's try that way then. Ah, there we go. Okay, so. Hopefully that pushes down into there, and it does seem to. And it just all seems to uh, fit into place. So if I turn that round now, you can now see that that base is now fitted. I'm going to bring that in closer there. Take it around and spin it around like so. And there we can see big cut out there. Okay, now the top. Right, so let's now attempt the top section. Now, where did that clip go? I think, yeah, it goes around that way. I'm just going to double check this time. So, there's a little clip. Now, it goes at the top of the Apple logo, so it will go around that way. Okay, so we are now going to clip, I'm assuming, just clips onto pla into place. Okay, that does seem to. Uh, have worked, I think. Uh, one way to tell. Let's lift this up. 
There we go. Awesome. You can see my extremely dirty screen on my MacBook Pro there. But um, yeah, if we just bring this around, and we can see it on top of the MacBook. Close that down. I just want to see how real sturdy this is. Okay. We can see the Mac logo there. I will start it up in a second just so we can see that light up. Um, yeah. Seems to fit pretty well. Okay. Let's just get some of these um, little grommet things out and take a look at those. Okay, so here we are. So here is this bag of what I refer to as grommets, really. Um, but there's some protection. What we've got is a uh, grip seal bag again. Let's just empty those out. There are a lot in here. There's obviously spares. Okay, so I'll just have a look under the light for my own benefit. Oh yes, it says on it actually. Ah, right, okay, so that says it's got printed on it SD. Um, you're not going to be able to see that, but you're just going to have to trust me that on that grommet, well, you might be able to see it, it's got printed on it SD. So that clearly goes into the SD slot. Let's just push that in, he says. Try to. So uh, this is where I do seem to be having a bit of difficulty. You have to bear with me. Uh, maybe I have to have that open. Let's open that. Might be a bit easier if we open up the. Okay, I'm just going to pause this video and see if I can get this in. Okay, here we are back. So I've got that in. But what I've actually, I think, I discovered is there are different size. Just trying to get that zoomed in different sized ones um because that one does seem to be smaller Let me just explain let's put that down there that's the one i was trying to get in and that's the one that i did fit in um and they do appear to be get it zoomed in two different sizes um, and they appear to be to me to me but anyway what i'm not going to do is put all these in because to be fair i'm not going to use these um i'm not going to be taking them in taking them out because i do use most of the slots on my um, MacBook on a regular basis. So I put those back in the bag. I'm going to start up my MacBook Pro just to see what the Apple logo looks like through that case. Okay, so there we go, and there we go now with my MacBook Pro started up, and you can see the Apple logo. What I would also do is just dim these lights. Just bear me a second, just turn all three of my lights out that I've got on my setup here. Okay, so whether that's made much difference for you, but anyway, hopefully you get to see how that lights up there so you can indeed see it through the case so first impressions does seem pretty cool i like the look and feel of this um case something i did want to get anyway um but anyway that was my kind of unboxing and fitting and mini review really of this sand series case let's get that package again i'm sure you can see it for yourself sand series case for macbook in this case this is a 13 inch macbook pro um anyway guys hopefully you did enjoy this video if you did give it that big thumbs up and any comments questions feedback leave down in the comments section any comments question or feedback like i said leave down in the comments section and if you haven't subscribed to this channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button whilst you're there head over to the other links in the description to geeky bricks facebook instagram etc 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 and take a look at those if you like them subscribe to them that just leaves me to say i look forward to seeing you all in the next video cheese bye for now, everyone bye